Hello, everybody. Um, I'm today. I'm going to talk about uh, Carly Russell, the young lady who who went missing, and I've been listening to the different um, videos and bloggers sharing their opinion with people calling in. Um, I just want to say this. I feel that she had some type of a mental breakdown and that's what caused her to to claim the story that she claimed. I mean, no one was there, we weren't there. So before we jump to assumptions and make, make assumptions, you know, um, I feel that it's better to have all the facts laid out in front of us. So, uh, you know, we never know what's going on in someone's life. We, we don't know, uh, you know, that goes for this the young woman, Carly, that goes to anyone, that goes to all of us. I mean, we could have stuff that happened years ago and we can have um, a, a trigger that can bring back that memory and that can set us off. So, you know, that's, that's you know, where I'm coming from. So, um, you know, it's just not a good, it's not a good thing to assume and pass judgment because, you know, she's a, an overachiever. She's only a 25 year old woman and she's already doing her master's or she completed her master's in nursing. You know, she went to a, a very good um, HBCU. So, I mean, she's she's not an underachiever, so. And there's um there's been stuff online about a recent breakup with a boyfriend, so maybe that's what triggered her, to, to have this episode. I mean, no no one knows, no one knows. So. I just say to people, don't make judgments. Unless you walked in somebody's shoes, because you never know. And that's all I have to say. So I'm glad that she's back home safely. And yes, if this was a hoax, this is going to obviously be some, there will be legal ramifications that she's going to be have to be held accountable for. Um, but I mean, if it was some type of a mental health episode incident that she has and she was never diagnosed for, um, that, that falls into a gray area. So. I would just say to people, just be compassionate and know all the facts before you judge. Till next time, have a good day.